Welcome back to Disney After Work. We are here on a Wednesday. Disneyland is open until 11 p.m. Keller Adventure closes at 9. I'll be going into Disneyland only because tonight I'm going to be on a podcast in about 15 minutes from 7.30 to 8.30. So I'm going to go to the Grand, Conf Grand Californian Hotel and do the podcast. And then we're going to go and watch the Wondrous Journeys projections. There are no fireworks tonight. There aren't any fireworks during the weekdays. So that's okay. So we're going to go watch the projections for a little bit and then see what we can get up to. Maybe go on a ride or two. But first I got to do the podcast. So... Let's go. If you've been following me for a while on TikTok or Instagram, you know that I always carry a pair of backup ears in my car and these are them right now. I got these customized like, gosh, almost over a year ago now on Main Street. They're pretty good. They're really comfy. They're like super snug on the head, but not like too tight, you know? So yeah, these are the backups. Also quick fit check as I'm crossing the uh, bridge right now. We got a mixed bag of things going on. <laughs> right now for the fit. I have the ears, the backup ears. I have this jacket to keep me super warm tonight. I have a Jack Skellington Holiday Castle Life Creation sweatshirt, which is just something I pulled out this morning because I was rushing. And then I'm wearing jeans over my Lululemon leggings because it's 65 degrees and I'm still, I have goosebumps right now. I'm such a wimp when it comes to the cold. I get just get cold so easily. So, and I got my old, old Adidas shoes on. So there you go. If you have brought your own food and beverages. All right, we are en route to the Grand Californian lobby. I'm a few minutes late. Okay, we are done with the podcast. It's the Walt's Apartment podcast, by the way. Super fun. Love those guys. And we are heading to Jolly Holiday to get the beef theory toasted sandwich that I ordered for, at like 4 o'clock today. I ordered it for right now because I thought this would be a good time. And it is. Right, we are now en route to Jolly Holiday. I'm so excited for this sandwich right now. All right, we are here. All right, we got it, y'all. I also got the 100th anniversary trifle, which I'm really excited to try for dessert. Looks good. Seriously, the best sandwich that Jolly Holiday has ever created. You've got the really good meat in the sandwich. Bread's awesome. Consomme is phenomenal. I mean, it's just, mm. I'm trying not to be gross on camera, sorry, but it is so good and such a comfort food for right now. I also did try the 100th anniversary trifle right there. It's good, it's very sweet. Um, I wish there was a little bit more of a cake layer in there. I like to have my trifles with like a sponge cake or something somewhere in the middle. It doesn't have that. It's more like cheesecake, strawberry, frosting, um, I think some sort of mousse and then cookie crumbles at the bottom. So it's okay, I'll show you up close real quick. This is kind of what she looks like here. It's good, I'm a sweets person, so I am gonna like eat it all, no problem, but you know. It could be just, just, just a tad better. I also really wanna talk about the news that came out today from the first quarter earnings report that Mr. Iger stated that we are getting a Toy Story 5, a Frozen 3, and an Avatar experience here at the Disneyland Resort. No idea what that means. That could, that's a myriad of things that that could potentially mean. So we'll see. Um, I don't think it's necessarily gonna be a ride or an attraction. I think it's just gonna be like a meet and greet or a walkthrough area of some sort. It's cause an attraction would take them like forever to build. So anyways, those are just my thoughts as I'm sitting here and eating my sandwich for dinner. So I have yet to see the way of water. I haven't seen it yet. I just haven't had three hours to dedicate to it, so hopefully I'll go see it soon. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna finish this and then we're gonna go snag a spot for the projections. There's no fireworks tonight. We're gonna snag a spot for the projections, probably next to Small World, because that's a good place to watch them. And I'll see you guys there. I said you could 